everyone! This lesson will cover two of the four main roles in Cambodian classical dance, um, and this will be the Nerong and Yep. And so if you're interested in the other two roles, check out lesson six. And so let's get into it. So the Nerong is a male role, and we'll start off by talking a little bit about that. And we will watch a short clip of a dance that it appears in, which is Roam Det Monorom. And this means the dance of heavenly gods and goddesses for happiness. And it tells um, a story of the deities dancing in heaven happily. And also notice that the Niang appears in this video as a goddess. So while we watch this clip, I want you to consider these questions. One being, um, remember the Niang's costumes from the previous lesson? How do the costumes differ from the costume seen in this dance? And pause the video as needed to compare the Nanong's costume and movements with the Niang's. And what emotions do all of the dancers express? And what mood does the music set? <laughs> we see in the costume for the Niang in this dance compared to other dances that we've seen in other lessons is that the crown that she's wearing is much taller and skinnier compared to other crowns that we've seen before so far. And then for the next question, so the Niang's costume, you'll see that, that he's wearing shoulder pads and you'll also see that the costume overall is completely different. Um, for example, the Niang is wearing like shorter short sleeves whereas Nerong has long sleeves. And then um, with the movements too, you'll see that the Nerong is much more masculine compared to the Niang. And um, going up talking talk about the emotions, the dancers express happiness and joy and the music sets this mood as it's very upbeat and joyful. Alright, <laughs> so the next role in Cambodian classical dance is the Ye. So Ye means giant or demon and we'll be watching a clip of one of the dances that it appears in which is Rowam Oni Mekala and this dance is, a is about the fight between Riam Eso who is a demon of the storms and Moni Mekala who is the goddess of the seas. And you'll notice that Riam Eso is the Ye character in this dance, and Moni Mekala is the Nian character in this dance. And so they're fighting for the control of Moni Mekala's magical crystal ball, which she is trying to protect from Riam Eso. And if you're interested in learning more about this story, feel free to check it out on YouTube. Um, there is a video on this story. And yeah, so. Some questions that um, you can discuss while we watch this clip is one, what ways does Ram Aso move differently from Moni Mekala? And two, being how is Moni Mekala's costume different from the Niangs that we've seen before? And three, being what emotions do the dancers express in this clip?
for the first question, you'll notice that as they walk toward forwards and backwards, Ryo Mei So moves his legs much higher and also moves much more aggressively than um, Moni Mekala. Um, Moni Mekala moves very gracefully and um, gently as well. You'll also see that um, Moni Mekala's costume in here, um, just like in Rwam Det Manorom, her crown is very tall and skinny. Um, you'll also see that her outfit is in all blue to represent how she is the goddess of the seas. And now for the third question about what emotions the dancers express, you can see that the yet moves much more aggressively and you can see um, Ryo Mei So's desire to obtain the crystal ball whereas Moni Mekala is moving, um, you can see that she's expressing more of a defensive state or, and you can see how she's trying to protect the crystal ball. So yeah, um, feel free to choose one or both of the coloring sheets to color um, and try to color using the same um, color scheme that you see in the videos. These coloring sheets are called Rwam, Rwam Det Manorom and the Yet. And um, also notice that the Yet in the coloring sheet is holding a cup, whereas the Yet in this clip was actually holding an axe. So this means that although the role is the same, the character from the clip is different from or it could be different from that in the um, coloring sheet. <laughs> Thank you for watching and see you at the next lesson.